The Return to Signal is a brand new automatic feature for flyability's Elios 3. When the signal is lost between the drone and the remote control, the drone will backtrack autonomously until it gets the radio signal back. With RTS, you'll never fear to lose your drone anymore due to low radio signal, and you will be enabled to fly the extra distance in marginal RF conditions so you can better adapt flight plans according to the environment. But how does this new feature work? During a flight, the Elios 3 monitors its live video feed and communicates with the controller as it transmits the footage. When the drone detects a problem with this transmission, RTS is initiated. On the pilot side, signal loss means that the live video feed has been disconnected or is jumping. The cockpit flight app will show a pop-up that the signal has been lost and the drone will begin the RTS sequence. After 5 seconds, the flight mode on the top right corner of the cockpit interface will now display auto. The LADs on the drone will become blue and Elios will start flying backwards on his past trajectory. Once the drone has flown to a point where the video connection is re-established, you can take control again and continue the flight. You can also stop the return to signal countdown or the RTS itself by simply pressing the ATI Sport button on the back right side of the RC or the red pause button on the cockpit pop-up. However, for this functionality to operate, certain conditions must be fulfilled. First of all, the drone battery must be above 10%. Secondly, the RTS availability indicator, top left corner of the cockpit display, needs to be green. If this indicator is red, the function is not available. The indicator will be red at the beginning of each flight, as the drone needs to fly minimum 5 meters for RTS to work. After this distance, the indicator will turn green and the function will be available. The RTS indicator will turn red also in case of a hard drone collision or in case the drone is stuck or hooked somewhere before losing the signal. The function can become unavailable also in case of extremely dusty environments of strong winds or when flying really fast. This feature is a game changer for complex drone inspections and will allow you to feel more confident pushing the drone to the limit even in challenging environments and gather more data during your flights without the risk of losing your Helios 3.